Look at me, 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 look at me now. Fuck, are you kidding me? You're my d Up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. Well, he's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with a beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Both fighters are 31, with big differences in height and reach. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 254 pounds. Fighting out of Nagoya, Japan, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Okay, could take yourself at all time, will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. The fighters touch him up. Ready? Ready? All right, crowd getting excited as this fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist. But on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five to and you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Just out of range with that left hook. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, nice check on the leg kick offering there. Yeah. 
circling towards the left. High level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Lee. Big ball from punch land. Now we get back to range. Back to the well with that right hand, it's no good. Beautifully placed in time kick there by Lee. Wow, what a head kick! Nice straight punch. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Oh, yeah, right here. Went for the inside leg kick. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Punch is blocked. They continue to exchange. Punch over the top. Trying to establish that jab once again. Big kick land. The one-two punch is true. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. Oh, big punch land. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, he got everything behind that kick. He's open for that uppercut. Let's go. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Nice. Just misses with a left hook there. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Blocks the shot. Beautiful right hook counter. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the ladder rounds. Pretty good right hand. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Effective punch there by Lee. Oh, nice straight left. Final seconds. Trying to kick the leg out. Five minutes in the books. All right, DC, let's look at some of the highlights from the last round. Lots of the replay guys to choose from. Yeah, man, these guys stood on a quarter in the middle of the octagon. Take one to give one. Over and over, each guy landed, and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here. He doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Flush right hand is true. Lands with the right hand. 
Nice kick. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Oh, nice strike landed there by Lee. Huge block there. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. out of range with the big right hand. Powerful leg kick lands. Missed with that right hand. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Try to establish that jab. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, nice right hand. Nice defense there, huge block. And he caught the kick. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Good stick. Right hook to the head block. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, really making good use of his reach advantage as he lands the straight punch there. Another shot lands upstairs. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Leg kick. Beautiful body kick. Nice punch lands over the top. Just out of the range with that right hand. Oh man, his leg kicks are outstanding and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see as the punch starts to slow down, he cannot take many of those kicks. Those leg kicks, man. That's his investment. His investment is in the leg kicks. That's how he slows these guys down and breaks them down. You don't know when that leg kick is coming. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Good punch. Big body kick. Back and forth we go. Just misses with the straight left hand. He blocks the punch. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Looping left hand misses the target. And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, beautiful combination of kicks. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pull it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Nice punch by Lee. Nice head kick. Just misses with that one. Get him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Well, what a round it was, especially from a striking standpoint. DC, take us through. High-level striking. I mean, this is what people come through the doors to see. Two men stand on a quarter, chest to chest, forehead to forehead, and let it all fly. I'm surprised nobody went out, but it does excite me for the next round.
All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go Ready? with our next round. Ready? High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fights with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kicks. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Well-placed kick there by Lee. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. Oh, that's a nice strike. He missed with that jab attempt there. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. And just misses with that big right hand. Oh, shot to the body connects there. He hasn't really thrown too many body strikes in this fight, but now, as this fight goes on, he is not discriminating, working the body, and those shots are gonna count. Nice strike. Head kick. on an uppercut right here in the inside. Well played on the head kick. Ooh, looking to set up that head kick. Straight punch land. Three minutes to go in round three. that offering from his opponent. In the past, we've seen him sort of lean on the toughness. Tonight, he's leaning on the defense. And you see the evolution of the fighter in front of us. He doesn't have to be tough anymore. The more he can slip a strike, the more he can prolong his career. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Lands flush with that right hand. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Oh, tagged him with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike. Oh. And maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got to hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Visibly limping here. A big right hook coming. It's blocked. Beautifully timed and placed kick there by Lee. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. Got clip with the right hand. Lee going for the head kick. No dice. Big head kick land. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Oh, clipped him with the overhand. Unable to land with that punch. Ten seconds, let's go, He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, 
he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, so next round underway here. And you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp. And it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. Big head kick lands. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Oh, looking to land the leg kick. That one checked. Over and over, he's landed some big body kicks. How about that shin? Ooh, blocks the shot. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Well, missed on that one. Liver kick. Head off the center line, slips the punch. range with that kick attempt. So the counters with an effective punch there, and at least in that situation, it paid to have the advantage in reach. Oh, nice punch there by Lewis. He's landing a nice left hook there, I, I feel. Changes his stance. Just over three minutes to go. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, nice hand speed as the counter with the right is good. Superman punch lands! It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Now connects with a right. Back to the jab now, no good. Lands the right hand. Right hand, then a left. Right punches there. Lee's kick to the body here. That one appeared to be blocked. Good punch lands. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it stop going. Oh, he heard a battle of the jab. Unable to connect there. 90 seconds to go. Beautiful strike. Oh, caught him with the head kick. Lands to the body there. Lee's kick is blocked. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Missed with that attempt. Under a minute now to go in the round. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect, so fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land from anywhere. He 
loaded up on that right hand, too. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Head kick. Lee's hook shot blocked. That one was telegraphed. Good job by the defense. 15 seconds to go. Ten seconds to go in round four. Beautiful punch. Twenty minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, so a huge five minutes turned in by him there. Good work with those leg kicks. Real good job with the leg kicks. Just really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh. He did a great job of finding an opening and taking full advantage of it. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are gonna really start to take effect. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Nice kick. Going to the body there with the right kick. Another big head kick land. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Connects with the right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Beautiful leg kick for him. Real nice body kick lands. Great punch landed with so much power. Oh, beautiful counter with the jab. Right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that punch. Whip his hip into that kick. Yeah. Lee's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. Come on, buddy. Keep your hands up. Let's go. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch him punch like this puts a smile on my face. How good is that right hand? Under three minutes remain in round five. Nice job to land the knee there by the taller fighter. And I think I just heard Daniel Cormier say, I wish I was a little bit taller. Oh, he counters with a beautiful jab to the head. We told you off the top he's got a decided advantage in reach. And he put it to good use there. All right, well, it's late in the fight. Time is of the essence. And when you're clearly losing and you know you need a finish, risk management goes out the window. Oh, yeah. No more risk management. Either get knocked out or you can knock him out. One way or the other, you're gonna lose. You can lose by decision or you can lose by knockout. But at least when you go for the knockout, you give yourself a chance to try to find your shot. That's a big strike right there. Oh, that right hand is on point. Lee's shot is blocked. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Ball combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. So accurate when he decides to attack. It oh! is a strike to throw. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, huge block. Nice leg kick. All right, lands a kick there, pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Just misses with the right. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the feet. 
He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. Great punch. Nice body kick. a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly, and it hurt his opponent very bad. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. Oh, big left hand there. Punch to the body is blocked. Ooh, what a punch. Popping his shots pretty well here early. Whoa! decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 50-45, 49-46, and 50-45. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Well, he did not get the finish that he certainly prioritized when we sat down with him in our fighter meeting, but a win is a win. He gets it done by unanimous decision. And he said he wanted to finish, but sometimes your opponent's not willing 